what is going on youtube pps here back um it is saturday we did not have a video like this yesterday um we just had past the prop in the afternoon um really good day overall yesterday um hit a couple long shots which was cool um had a couple nba props come through for us as well so on a nice little win streak here going into today's slate it is massive it has all three wagons on it but um Decide I'm going to keep those in the in the VIP chat. I'm going to keep those in those. I have a ton of other plays ready to go for today, whether it be UFC, um, other college basketball spots. Um, but, yep, we are, just heads up, we are running a Super Bowl promo. Uh, if you guys want to get in on that, it, hit my DMs up. We'll uh, get you involved. Um, and in the fun little group that we do have and post all our plays in and stuff like that. So, I will be doing that for the Super Bowl weekend here. So if you want to let me know, DM me. Uh, my Twitter will be in the link of the description here. Um, so, yeah, coming off of yesterday, feeling pretty good. Um, seeing seeing the slates pretty well. Again, this is my tips to anybody capping today is you don't have to bet on every game. There is so much action. You don't need to be betting on 35 games. Um, I'll probably have like 8 to 12 games that I really like that I will have money on obviously have a ton of action on the fights tonight. So I'm very excited for that. Um, but without further ado, hit that like button quick, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Um, and let's get right into it. I'm going back to the Mac guys. Um, going back to a team that just won me money. Um, and I see no reason why we can't see some more points being scored in this one. Um, I really like this Buffalo team. I really, I really like Ball State for overs as well. Um, Buffalo just has a very, very deep roster. Um, like I said, Imbala is fantastic um, in the post, twelve and eight on the season. Sagu is one of my favorite dudes to take in DFS. Um, Fifteen points, five assists, three rebounds, a steal a game. Just one of those guys that can get the job done everywhere. And obviously, Jonathan Williams. Um, getting 19 and six per game this year um, has been playing extremely, extremely well. Um, now we go over to the Ball State side today. Um, Ball State is a team I have backed on overs in the past. Um, the only reason I do is because they are so, so bad on defense. One of the worst defenses I've really seen in a long time, guys. Um, they did beat Toledo. But I did have Toledo's team total over, and they still hit that, right? So let's just check the last four games, or five five games, okay? So Northern Illinois, 67 points. They're not very good. They they beat a directional Michigan school, but they scored 72 on them. It was 83-72. Ohio drops 87 on them, and Ohio plays pretty slow. Um, Toledo, um, they won by 10, or – Ball State won by 10, but 93-83, and Central Michigan just dropped 90 on these dudes. There is no defense going to be played on the Ball State side. Buffalo is good on defense, but not great. Middle of the pack, but they play at the 37th fastest pace, around 71 possessions. Looking here, Ball State is about one and a half possessions behind, um, sitting at 78th um, ranked in the country. Um, so we should see a pace up spot for Ball State. Ball State ranks bottom 30 in defensive efficiency. Um, just one of those teams that you want to back um, on the over side, not on their um, on their side, like betting their spread or anything. Ball State is 4-0-1 to the over in their last five games. Buffalo is 2-2 two and two to the over in the last four with a push in the fifth one as well. Um, and I think that's big because Ball State – is now going to play Buffalo in Buffalo here. There's just really no way I see Buffalo getting stopped. I think the team total on the Buffalo side is probably the best other play in this. But I think Ball State's going to be fine. I think Ball State will will find a way to keep this pace rolling. Um, if we look into a little bit more of the numbers here, Buffalo ranks 243 in points allowed per game at at uh, 71.2 ball state's averaging 75 points per game so i mean they're no slouch on the offensive end it's just that defensive side of the ball that struggles um buffalo ranks 21st in the country in points per game at 79.6 and ball state is 343 in points allowed at 77.3 so it's an 11 point spread i think buffalo gets up there 
into the 90s. I think the team total is there as well. Um, but I also could see Ball State being like a like a sleeper, like a, a walkthrough game for Buffalo here. And the game stays close. We get the fouls at the end, and we still hit it here. Um, with an 11.5 point spread here in this game, we're getting close to not being in foul territory. But if we if Buffalo covers this spread, we're hitting this over. Buffalo is going to score 100 points if this if they're going to win by 11.5 or 12. So I really like Buffalo today. Um, obviously, have a ton of other bets out, but uh, I don't have too much time today to just pop in and drop like six plays. So we're going to go with the one. Um, again, if you guys do want some extra plays, DM me, shoot me a message. Um, we'll get you hooked up. Um, but quick six-minute video, popping in on some action here. So thank you guys so much. If I don't see you guys tomorrow, ha happy Super Bowl. Hopefully you make some money tomorrow as well. Um, and rolling with the Buffalo Bulls, Ball State over 155 at minus 110, 1.5 units. Um, looking forward to cashing another one with you guys today. And uh, again, please drop a like, um, comment below what you think is your favorite play of the day, and we'll, we'll make some money today. So thank you guys so much. Talk tomorrow. Peace.